So, Ian, too scared to show his face, is he? Ian's doing what Ian does best, talking to suppliers, getting the lease sorted, finalising the business plans. And you're chasing the money? Pie and mash, I thought would be right up your street. <laughs> you got some front, haven't you? Don't ask, don't get. And that's how you wormed your way out of Nick, is it? I'll do whatever it takes to survive. Mm. You don't exactly scream trustworthy, does it? Grass it on your cell, mate. I didn't know her anything. Mm. And why would I be any different? This is a straight down the line business arrangement. Yeah, you, you have your old man shot, and you run away with his kids, and you, you marry another geezer under a, a fake name, and then you leave him high and dry. Would you like me to list your indiscretions, Phil? Yeah, but the difference is I ain't in your kitchen begging for money. I am not begging. All I'm saying is it wouldn't take much for you to stab me in the back, would it? <sighs> I've spent the last 25 years running away from things. I just want to settle down, surrounded with my kids, and rebuild my life. Surely you can get that. At least I'm sticking with the same bloke. Last time I was here, you were knocking around with Kathy, then Sharon, I think, now. Everybody deserves a second chance. And this is just a second, is it? It's a good investment. Yeah, but I'm in business with George. And you could call that a conflict of interest. Does he even need to know? It's, it's too messy. I don't need that hassle in my life. Phil, I want you as an investor. I don't want to see you in an apron peeling spuds. Though I think I'd pay to see that. <laughs> Silent partner, eh? My lips are sealed. You've come running to win. Oh, you're having a laugh, innit? You? you ain't even told him. But we don't need his money. We just talk about no, this. No, 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 we can't. Phil! No, you ain't changed, have you? Still running around behind his back, plotting and planning. Well, he might be mug enough to, to believe your promises. But I ain't. 